Hey guys, this is Dr. Hub. Today we look at the diagnostic. So this is going to be the diagnostic algorithm of the pulmonary TB. So diagnostic algorithm of the pulmonary TB and this is according to the NTEP that is the National Elimination Program and this is the 2020 guidelines. So what happens here is, so in any case of presumptive of pulmonary TB, they should undergo a sputum examination. So first thing will be to undergo the sputum examination and along with you also do a chest x-ray as well as the CB. So in case the sputum and the chest x-ray is normal. So we are saying the sputum and the chest x-ray. So these are normal. So what is done is to rule out the TB and refer so what we do is rule out TB and then you refer. Next is in case of if the sputum is positive. So if the sputum you see is uh, positive. So in this case and the CB negative is also CB net is also positive. So the uh, sputum is positive, CB net is positive. So there's microbiologically it's confirmed case of TB. So this means that it is, as per the microbiology, it is completely positive. So let's look at the protocol. So in case of the protocol, first we have the CV NAT. So in the protocol, first is the CV NAT. And after the CV NAT, there is uh, when the MTB is detected. So first let's see in case it is not detected. So in the MTB, it is not detected. So in this case, what happens? So in this case is we consider alternative diagnosis and we refer. So we consider the alternative diagnosis. And then there is also we refer to specialist, we refer to the specialist. Then there is an alternative diagnosis as well as this clinically then you clinically diagnose as TB. So this is the protocol in case of the MTB is not detected. Next is we look at in case the MTB is detected. So here the MTB this will be detected. So in such case next will be the use of rifampicin. There is rifampicin. So in case rifampicin we have three criteria here. So it can be sensitive. So in case it is sensitive, there is nothing but the microbiologically confirmed TB. So sensitive means it is microbiologically, it is the confirmed TB. Next is we look at the resistant. So in terms of resistance, it is the management of resistant TB, the management of the resistant TB. Next is we look at the intermittent. Inter, inter, in, determinate. So here is we have to repeat the CB NAT. So you repeat the CB NAT and the second sample. Then if the second sample is indeterminate, so the second sample it is uh, in determinate. So then you take a sample for the liquid culture. So take sample for the liquid culture. So this was all about the diagnostic algorithm for the pulmonary TB. So to learn and grow daily like this, please do subscribe.